Hey guys, what's up? Today we are doing Sex Education Season 2, Episode 5. And in the last episode, quite a bit of things have happened. So Maeve confessed her feelings for Otis, which then Otis ended up telling her that he did like her as well, but he is over her now, which I think is total BS. I don't think he's over her at all. Um, he ended up, him and Ola were supposed to end up having sex, and then they didn't. Um, primarily because of Maeve and also because of all of that situation Ola gave him an ultimatum to not to ever hang out or like see or be with Maeve um, which I don't think is going to work out at all um, also I think Ola probably is forming a little bit of a crush for Lily um, but judged off of a little bit of the last episode um, and then we have Eric, who is caught in between two guys, Raheem and Adam, and he's trying to decide on who he really wants to be with, I think, because Raheem flat out asked him if he would be his boyfriend, but he was he didn't really answer him. So I think, I think maybe Eric is leaning more towards Adam, and maybe that's why he didn't say anything to Raheem. Um, but I'm not quite sure. It's just my opinion. Um... But anyway, if you guys want to check out this episode completely unedited or get early access for the next one, please feel free to check out my Patreon in the link in the description below. But yeah, let's go ahead and jump into this episode. Is she dreaming? I think she's dreaming. <laughs> yep, she's dreaming. I think I might have killed him. <laughs> yeah, this sounds like Lily. Knew it. <laughs> so they've been doing this a couple of times, I see. Packing disaster. All right. What? Hey, Jean. Hi, Eric. What are you wearing? What are you wearing, bro? And you got a laptop. Why have you got a laptop charger? Look what I ordered. Uh, <laughs> Is that not for a dog? To say thank you for all the babysitting Cynthia's yet to agree to. She's gonna love them. That's emotional manipulation. I know. I'm an evil genius. Oh, Do that. probably for one of their cats. I've got an NA meeting today. I want you to see how well I'm doing. Aww. Plus, there's free biscuits. I really hope the mom's not gonna screw I'm over kind. this time. He likes barbecue flavored Doritos. He bites his bottom lip when he thinks about something really difficult. And he's spoken to me exactly 26 times using a total of 556 words. Yeah. Right, okay. Oddly specific. I was talking more like, what does he like to do in his spare time? Oh, uh, he works at Pegasus Hobbies and Games on the weekend. Why? I wonder if she got those tennis shoes just to walk that way. Mm. Uh, my wife Delilah and I, we, I take our little He's boys married? out of the city as much as we can. <laughs> I don't know who's married. It's like so pretty. Yeah. Uh, I think. It's a raven. It's a crow. Or a crow. I'm not good with birds either. Oh, this this <laughs> sounds like black. A, the right place they can. Is he always like this? Oh, they do try and relax, Otis. Try and relax. That's nice. true. Oh, Otis doesn't know how to relax. I think we should get our first hike in right now. Well, I mean. No, we should set up the tents first. Would, no, I yeah, think I was gonna it's time say it. we try to access our inner wild man. I think we should I get talk with your dad. I do agree with Otis on this whole situation. No wild garlic, Terry. Yes, I can, Remy. Yes, I can. Relax. Don't leave your stuff there, though. Something's probably gonna end up happening to it. <laughs> She's gonna lose it. <laughs> Too much, too much running. Too much. <laughs> okay, he's making it. Hi. Whoa. Honestly, don't worry Oops. about it, Bev. It's fine. It happens all the time. You keep calling her Bev. Her name's actually Viv. Viv. Just friends. <laughs> you have casual sex sometimes. Ah. Uh. Right. Well, uh, what can I help you with, Viv? Lord the ring. Speak. I love that game, but we've just sold our last one. 
shit. Tell you what, maybe I could take your number down and I can let you know when it comes back in Ooh. stock. Ooh. And I just hope you'll be able to find it in yourself to forgive me. She tried to... Is she thinking What's it's because it, she's wearing? with a whole bunch of that wasn't other people? That was just another excuse. Come and have a look if you like. I'm not interested. Except you kind of are. I'm not. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> yeah, it might be easy if you just carry them inside for me. I think he likes her. Right. Hands above the hits now, Jerry. It's not the 1960s anymore. <laughs> I don't know. She might even like him too, I think. We'll see. If you haven't mm. been touched in a long time, are you still going to feel anything? I can assure you, vaginal pleasure does yeah. not diminish <laughs> with age or lack of contact. In fact, there are many ways that we... It's extra sensitive. Yeah. Take your hand away. Yeah, it's gonna. She knows what's gonna happen. I kissed Remy. Oh. How is he gonna feel about that? Oh man. Okay, never have I ever had to choose between my girlfriend and the girl that I'm secretly in love with. Oh! Oh, oh is this about the mysterious um, me? Actually, huh? oh, <laughs> it's a very similar situation with him. Might not be girlfriends, but... Mm. Uh, yeah, so the dad's basically telling him to yeah, be with me. Um, this is... They're gonna end up being yeah, lost. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> Yep, and then this is what happens when you don't already have shelter. Do you think it means something if I'm having sex dreams about girls? I don't know. Yep. Don't ask Google. It's where it all starts. <laughs> I think it should say, once an addict, always an addict. You're a real dick, you know? Yeah, a little bit. I thought everyone did. I, I only noticed girls. Mm -hmm. everywhere. He's saying that on purpose. I'm a pansexual, apparently. What, like, fucking pots and pans? <laughs> I knew a guy who used to like to stick his dick in the suction pipe of a vacuum cleaner. It's normal. <laughs> I don't think that's normal. That you're attracted to the person, not the sex or gender. You're supposed to be here three hours ago. I walked. I'm really enjoying walking at the moment. It's so evaporating. Invigorating? Yeah, that's what I, I was going to say evaporating. <laughs> <laughs> that was an accident. Uh, Do you not want me to? What makes you think I don't? Keep slapping me in the head. Uh -huh. Maybe we can watch a film or something. <laughs> I wonder what she gave her. Did she give her a uh, um, vibrator? Or dildo? What is it? She gave her something. What'd she give her? Yep. Mm hmm. <laughs> Is he gonna like walk past or something? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I do see you, by the way. I see a girl that gave Dex her number. <laughs> <laughs> see you later. We are not lost. What, what, what does a friend of say? Lost. <sighs> Why don't we get a hotel? No, we're not getting a fucking hotel. Hey, two rooms, please. I love her. I think she's so sweet. I want a divorce. Oh, damn. Good for you. He's an asshole. Good for you. I'm gonna give her a makeover. Aww. Why do you keep ignoring Raheem? Because I'm hanging with you. 
I don't want to be one of these people that are suddenly obsessed with who they're dating. Well, that's very mm -hmm. sweet, Eric. But why are you ignoring him? Didn't he ask you to be his boyfriend? Just tell Otis about Adam. He gave me a blowjob. <laughs> and since he's been back, we've been going on all these late night walks where we go in and smash stuff and then we kiss. You don't like being the one left behind for a change. No, Eric, this is about you being so self-hating that you'd let yourself fall for someone who literally treats you I like shit. I think they're shit. both don't right on a couple of things, me, but they're both wrong on a couple of things. You don't know what my reality is. Okay. You're right, His right. wife wanting a divorce yeah, or Delilah something? Delilah is, uh, has left me for someone yeah. else. No oh, good. It's really hard for me to feel bad for him <laughs> after everything he's done, but. What's wrong? Oh, she's dreaming again. I'm gonna kiss you. She is quite a bit taller than her. Good thing for insurance, oh, eh? shit. You did get insurance, didn't you? to make I think his dad is kind of shitty but gave him the right advice uh, I said I love you why are you laughing because she doesn't it, you don't love me yeah and I've just realized that I definitely don't love you that's why I told you that was the wrong mistake to make to text Maeve that. Uh, Made a choice, but it was the wrong one. Shit, no people. I don't care. Mm. So the difference between Raheem and Adam. Is she gonna be with someone? I'm gonna kiss you, okay? Maybe Lily just doesn't know what she wants. pieces this whole damn episode <laughs> oh my gosh i just think my heart has been broken so many times during this episode like with the with mave and her mom and mave and otis eric and adam not so much the um remy part but gene and Jacob. just <laughs> this whole episode has just broke my heart <sighs> Um, if you guys want to check out this episode completely unedited or get early access for the next ones, please feel free to check out my Patreon in the link in the description below. And if you will for me, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next episode.